sure I made a save state between parts. Eee! Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. Things are getting pretty intense around here. Uh oh, we got- no, not the crackly audio again. This is it. Once we defeat Maladus, all of this can end. Just like it's on certain cutscenes it decides, eh, eh, I'm not gonna let the audio work properly. <laughs> I shall accompany you from here on out. It's too dangerous for just the two of you. Um. Uh, well, didn't you guys just battle each other ish? But your wounds from our battle are still fresh. Exactly. And what's to come will be very demanding. It's my turn now, Master. It's the least I can do. Well, uh. Um. I guess we could use burn. Sure, sure. Woo! <laughs> yes. Anji, it's time for you to rest. And I hate this crackling audio too, but we must persevere. Link and I can take care of them. After all, it's just Melodus and Cole. It'll be a piece of cake. Wow, this might be the worst audio yet, actually. You should stay behind too, Burn. You're both too injured to help us now. Dot, 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 dot. As you wish, my dear. It's up to you two, then, Link and Zelda. May the spirits be with you. Alright, let's get out of this place. Get out of Crackly Realm. <laughs> uh, uh, oh! Oh! I can do no more. You must go forth on your own. I think you know who can use that armor! Thank you for everything, Anjin! Heck yeah! It's time for us to go, Link! Alright! Let's do it! Le Zelda! In the armor, I can't carry that thing! <laughs> oh, but one last thing before we go. Um, once we put all this ugliness behind us, we'll both resume our normal lives. When that happens, what are you going to do? What will you become? Multi-choice, so that means let's save state over to here. Ah, uh, we'll say I don't know. <laughs> I see. Well, I think we can go now, Link. Can we? Can we really? Actually. Okay, load state. Number eight. Let's see if it's the same same dialogue here. Hmm? I see. Well, I think we'd go in all link. Really? Interesting. Interesting. I thought that there would be something different here. There you go. Engineer. <laughs> that was actually my uh, first choice. I see. Well, I think we can go in all link. Yeah, I guess that's it. <laughs> Alright. Had to check that out. You know. Her ancestors would be proud of her. All right, here we go. We're climbing up on top of the big bad boy itself. There's Cole. Oh no. Actually, oh yes, I've been waiting to beat on him for a while. You've gone far enough, Cole. This is where it ends. You again? The Demon King's return is now, you know. Yet here you are, making a nuisance of yourselves. <laughs> you insolent little fools! It's time you receive the punishment you deserve! Uh-oh. Um, I thought I disabled this thing. Holy Mother of Poop, the spirit train is back there. Uh, I, well, I guess we're stuck on top. I guess it doesn't much matter if we can just take him on this way, then. Your Majesty, your resurrection is complete! Oh, shoot, we side-quested too long! Please use your power to destroy these two! Oh, I shouldn't have gotten so many rabbits! Now nah, this would've happened no matter what. Holy poop! Yeah, I definitely shouldn't have came down this portal. Should've just stayed in a border village, had a good time, had a... Snack of a coconut or something like that. This is it, Link. 
Okay, I guess it wouldn't matter. We'd have to face them down and they pop out of here anyway. Alright. Let's face our problems head on. And take on Maladus and Cole. So our objective here is to get good old Zelda in the Phantom Armor all the way to the end here. So let's begin by putting the pressure right off the bat, straight on ahead. And we've also got little ghostly rats popping out of nowhere here thanks to Cole and... Oh shoot, if any of them touches Zelda there, get your boomerang out, which I conveniently already have, because he'll control Zelda like a puppet, literally, and we'll be able to knock it out of her, uh, knock the armor out of his control thusly. Now, if you're trying to go, if you're trying to go, like, just straight on forward without any sort of uh, guarding or anything like that, we're gonna be lasered by Maladus down there, so ain't gonna work, yo. So, let's just go ahead and keep a Zelda up front as our human shield, or I should say our ghostly shield, and see if we can get her there ASAP because right now we can do nothing of the sorts to either of them yeah seriously they are completely invulnerable and also they can control the train like so to kind of offset the, the pathways and stuff like that to make it even trickier so that oh shoot so that uh, yeah rats get into our troubles yeah there we go Ghostly rats, they can't stop us though. Oh no no no. There is nothing they can do to, to stop us other than just stall us. Oopsie. <laughs> it's a little bit trickier when you get closer to the end there, but you know, that's the idea. It's it's supposed to be an uphill battle of sorts. You know, trying to get there and whatnot. Alright, ghostly rats. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. No shoot! Ah, you dared! You dared. Okay, that's ah. <laughs> it takes a little bit of practice to get this, but you'll, you'll eventually get there if you should. Uh, I got too far ahead of Zelda there. It, it, you'll eventually get it if you keep sticking to it. Just don't don't give up. Just keep powering through the rats. Keep powering through the rats. Those rats, they won't be able to stop us. Maybe I should actually be distracting Cole a little bit with my sword strikes, if at all possible. That, that might also be handy too. Maybe, as long as he's low enough for me to do so. Oh, this is actually looking pretty, pretty, pretty promising here. Okay, there we go, there we go. Yes, yes. Oh, got too close. I mean, actually got too far ahead. Okay, okay, okay. We got this, we got this. No, 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 you don't. Oh, poopers. How did that even, how did that even touch? Well, <laughs> I guess we don't got this. We don't got this just yet. But we will have this, I assure you. There is nothing. There is nothing that will stop us from victory, nor rats, nor ghosts. Oh, that was just cheap. <laughs> just, just like automatically, the rat just went right into her body the moment he spawned it. Okay, rat, rat, rat. No, you don't. Get away, get away. Okay, all the way over. All the way over. Next screen over. There we go. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. We got this. We got this. Lock on to... The body. Oh shoot, I didn't mean to touch it. Shoot, 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 shoot. Okay, alright. We got this. Come on, lock on, lock on. Get her over there. Get her over there. Yes! Alright. Ball of lights. Get her out. Get some arrows if you need to. <laughs> shoot the ball. Of... Now let us at the ball of light now. Make sure it's facing you when you shoot. Otherwise, you're not going to be able to uh, pull off a shot at it. Yeah. See that? See that? Otherwise, you're just going to bounce it off the armor. There we go. Yeah! That body back, Zelda. Struggle. Beat it up. Do what you need to. You can heal the bruises later. <laughs> yeah. Get in there. Get in there. Push in. Push in. You can do it. I, I, Majesty. I have faith in you. You're stronger than Melodus. You have a Triforce, probably, in this timeline. You won't escape this time, Melodus. Race me! Wing, be careful! Don't worry about me, just get away from Melodus! No, 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 I'm not! I'm not abandoning you now! 
No Suri Bobby. Is this thing finally destroyed? Man. Man. Okay. Alright. Holy Is on its back tail like a seal. <laughs> yes. That felt good. Link. Link. Please open your eyes, Link. Are you alright? Oh, uh, I guess she couldn't get her body back. Ah, uh, that sinks. Oh, oh no! Body! Gimme! Body! Gimme! Hmm? I guess that, uh, light arrow did something because it appears it couldn't hold on any longer. Oh ho! Zelda, get up there! Hurry! Go 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 go! Ha ha! I don't know why he bothered to dodge because she's a ghost anyway. What? What the? Oh no! Oh! Was I too late? Stop! The vessel belongs to His Majesty. Quickly, Your Majesty! You must hurry back to Zelda's body! Um, Zelda, you better get your body back quick if you can! Because that's kinda. that's kind of a problem over there. Why isn't this working? Work for the Phantoms? Uh! Huh? Oh, burn! You cannot give up now. Your body has the sacred power of the spirits. Now concentrate on reclaiming it. Burn, hold it together. <laughs> After all, didn't you say you wanted to have words with me? <laughs> there really is a sacred power in my body. Please, let it hear me. Tetra, please give me your blessing. Oh man. Oh man! Oh jeez! Go! Now! Right now! Link! Go catch her! Hurry! You can do it! <laughs> That's exactly what would happen if you tried to catch someone falling. It's too much force from falling. Oh, am, I, am, I, am, I, am I back? Yep! Yeah, you're back! Woohoo! I'm gonna miss those warp phantoms, though. Oh. Oh no. Burn! Uh, can you get out of that? Maybe we could help you? Oh. Bravo, your majesty! Bravo! But time is short, your majesty. Please do away with the boy and capture Zelda. Uh. Your majesty? Please no! And that's what you get for trusting pure evil. Although I suppose he was in him on himself, pure evil. So, eh, eh, it's about even. Holy poopers! This is looking like Ganon, but no, no, this vessel is rejecting my spirits. Crackly audio again, of course. I'm slipping from it. I can't hold on for long. But the world will crumble in the time I have left. Come on, Link. Let's settle this once and for all. For Burn and everyone else. Let's do it. Ready? Link, I'm going to concentrate on channeling my power. While I do that, please protect me from Melodus. Alright. 
So we start out over here and don't leave Zelda's side. You cannot do anything of the sorts. Except Garter. So just take your sword and knock these things around. I don't think you can use any of your other items to knock these things around, but if one hits Zelda... Oh! Let's try it again! The timer will reset and you'll have to do it all the way from the beginning all over again. Got it? Good. So let's not mess around here and let's do this for real Z's. It's just a matter of keeping up the protection. Tower Defense 101 right here. Also grab some hearts as you see them whenever you have like a break between the waves of fiery meteors and now he's doing curveballs here. Oh shoot, that's gonna hit her. Dang it. I took that one little nick and yeah, alas, alas, the cycle resets. The, the whole the whole waiting game here doesn't take that long or anything like that, but it's it's long enough that it it makes you feel the pressure, let's put it that way. <laughs> Alright, here we go. I'm gonna put my full concentration into this now, because we have no other choice but to do this, and otherwise it'll just continue on infinitely. So, let's do it for realsies now. No, no flaws whatsoever. Yeah, just like that. How you like those apples? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. <laughs> I will grab that heart too, because why not? Yeah, maybe this one too. Might as well keep ourselves recovering. By the way, you'll notice that the closer we get to her being all charged up, the, uh, the darker this area gets and the more she glows. So, here we go, final wave, right here, right here. And always do the spin attack when, you're really, when they're really close, so that she'll be able to hit all four of them guaranteed. Alright, we did it! Woo! Thank you for protecting me. I'm ready now, Link. Let's combine my sacred power with the power of the spear flutes. I think we can use them to weaken Maladus. Oh yeah. Take a look at the notes on the top screen. This is it. Just follow along with me, Link. So we go bop, 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 bop. Got it? Oh, that was terrible, but... <laughs> Perfect. Sort of iffy. We did it! The last song! Oh, this looks so cool as just one screen, like without any gap in between them. I mean, that, that looks perfect right there, other than some of the lighting effects. And with the power of the songs, we can't lose! We've got this battle in the bag. Well, almost. <laughs> it's still possible to lose, I suppose, but I'm pretty sure we'll be able to pull this off. Aha! It's got a weak spot on its back now. Now it's time to do some multitasking. Ready? Final phase. You distract Maladus, Link. When I see an opportunity, I'll shoot him in the back with the bow of lights. Alright. This is the last battle, so let's make it count. Alrighty, so let's get her all over to one side and start the distractions. Yep, just, just go ahead and whack him a couple of times with your sword and whatnot, no big deal. And when its back is turned sufficiently to Zelda, press that arrow icon on the bottom of the screen there. <laughs> And then what you'll be able to do is shoot an arrow, you know, you'll be able to control Zelda along with um, along with yourself there. That, hence the multitasking thing going on here. Alright, turn this way. There we go. Back to... Oh, really? That didn't hit? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Come on now. Don't don't be like that there, Maladus. I know your hitbox there is kind of small, but, you know, it's, we gotta... We, we gotta kill you eventually to end this game, right? Ah! How you like that? Probably not all that much, because you just screamed with pain. 
I'll get you over there. And then I'll turn around. Uh, that looks good right there. There we go. Beautiful. Woo! Alright. So now let's go ahead and attack that gem on its head. Only we kind of can't. We're kind of only hitting the horn, but we can break off the horn one at a time. How's that sound? I think that sounds pretty good. Because we'll eventually be able to get to that mark on your head. You may not like it, but it's gonna happen whether you like it or not. And we're gonna save this world whether you like it or not too. Oh, that was just terrible time for you to do that spin there, mister. Terrible time for you to do that spin, okay. <laughs> so yeah, needless to say, our regular attacks are doing nothing to him. It's just a matter of that we're trying to distract him from Zelda so that we can actually do some real deal damage uh, by being able to attack that gem on its head. Oh, oh, I thought that was perfect. Oh man, oh man, that was not perfect at all, was it? I'll continue distracting him, don't worry, don't worry, you got your body back though. That's that's what that's what we got here. That's what we came here for. All all to begin with. <laughs> ah, poopers. Ah, poopers. Okay, you know what? Actually, come down this way. Come down. Yeah, give me a little bit of a further distance away from Maladus here. There we go. No, no, try that. No, still not. Still not quite. Okay. Oh, oh, there we go. Yeah, that little little sunburst helps there, but it's not really a necessary thing because she's always aiming. She's always aiming for that weak spot. It's just often a matter of timing more than anything, and not the, so much the sunburst, I'd say. <laughs> it's like, see, there's a sunburst. See, that worked out fine, but, you know, you know, it's uh, I did it before without that, so, you know, don't need that. <laughs> attack, 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 get rid of that horn! Yeah, there we go. Alright, one more horn to go. And, of course, you go on the other side of the arena just, just to be extra feisty in that regard. Oh, so close! So close. Ooh, oh! Uh, we got this. No, 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 I said we got this. By the way, if you hit Zelda, you can pretty much do so in a limited amount of times, it seems like. It's just that he, he stops her from charging up the light arrow, and yeah, it's, it's just similar to the, to the whole keepy-uppy thing going on earlier. And now after this one hit, he'll finally be actually vulnerable. To some strikes! Yeah! Woo! Rub it, rub it, rub it! Attack, attack, attack! E e rub anywhere! Turn anywhere you please! Just attack! Attack and keep rubbing! E e Zelda, push in with me! Do it! Right into that gem! E <laughs> what a workout! Woo! And it's done. Sorry, Maladus, but you had to go. Woo! Bye bye, Gem. Bye bye, final boss. I will take this as a Darth Vader type no. That sounds about right. Yep. Yep. <laughs> I don't know why that that uh, that last song is easier to do than that middle. You know the uh, one with the red-haired locomo. I can't think of right offhand. I'm sorry. <laughs> Just yeah, but yeah, I don't know why that that last song, even though you're skipping around a lot with the notes, is easier than that one. I. I don't know, but I've always found this one to be significantly easier than the other one. The notes play properly, like, I, I mean, I should, not properly, I should say smoothly when you jump from one to one. So, maybe that's why, is because there isn't any sort of skippages. So it's all over now. So yeah, I still find that one easier than red-haired guys, but... Cool. And... And that crackling audio, it's not making my mood any better. We were too late. Oh, on Jean. Uh. I'm so sorry. Burn was... <coughs> oh, my cold is back. I forgot my body still had that. 
Vern was <coughs> trying to protect me. Yes, but there should be no regrets. He wouldn't have had it any other way. Besides, our kind are the servants of the spirits. We don't disappear that easily. Eh? Huh? Really? So Burn didn't die? What do you mean? See for yourself, my dear. Spirit is persistent, my dear. Burn may not have any memory of these events, but years from now, he'll return in a new form. Isn't that about the same as dying, though, like having all your memories wiped, basically? You see, as locomos, we weren't only meant to protect the spirit tracks, we were also meant to watch over mankind. But our protection is no longer needed. Even without the spirit's guidance, you will do well. So I think I will return to the heavens in the company of my old friend, Burn. Aww. Oh, for all is forgiven. What the? You have legs! Anjin, wait! Please watch over this land, my dear. And Link, you must help her. Looks like she's gone, too. Goodbye, and thank you. Thank you both. Yep, all the other locomoles are going along with her, including the one I can't remember the name of right now. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, that's terribly crackly audio. Man, emulator. You're just messing with me even to the very end. But I beat this game despite all the troubles you gave me. You can't stop me. No one can. Recording failure. No! No, it's fine. <laughs> so, these are the credits. These people made the game. I did not. I just made the walkthrough to help and entertain people. They are awesome for what they did with this game. It was fantastic. And Well, I should say it is fantastic. It will definitely be one of the best Zelda games out there. IMO. Yeah, as I said, this Zelda game, it... Well, actually, maybe I didn't tell this story. That maybe I didn't before. Well, basically, uh, the first time that I played this game, it didn't really resonate with me like super well or anything like that. But when I replayed the game, oh, oh no, oh no, it's it's that thing. Oh god, don't look at it directly. But yeah, when I replayed the game, you know, gave it another shot. I was like, you know, that this things are made a lot more brilliantly than I remember them. I don't I don't know why it didn't resonate with me the first time around. But after it did, I was like, you know. This game ended up being one of my favorite Zelda. <laughs> you know, it's got a lot of humor to it and everything like that, which fits me well as I love humor. It's also got those, you know, appropriately dramatic moments as well and, and whatnot. Uh, the tracks and how they were set up and whatnot with all the, the dark trains and armor chains and whatnot were also well thought out. For the most part, I was a little bit iffy about that dark realm area, but... <laughs> I just didn't know how to do that corner area, just like consistently, but I managed to get it at least, you know, that once on camera and whatnot, so we're all okay. And also, the crackly audio is gone. Heck yeah, baby! <laughs> I guess it's only like during certain cutscenes that it happens, so I guess it's not that big of a deal, but I, I don't know, I feel like that it ruins some moments with that. Because, you know, the, the beautiful music that set the tone was all going... <laughs> so, <laughs> but when you play this on your actual DS, you'll be able to get to get the proper atmosphere for it. But uh, other than that, you know, the gameplay was all accurate. 
it as far as I could tell, aside from a couple of graphical bugs here and there, like maybe some extra black lines over at Hyrule Castle's upper floors, you know, between the tiles and stuff like that, but... Yeah, it was, it was indeed fully playable from start to finish, and there's Ferris! He's having a good time still photographing trains! And now that we got the spirit train and we're friends with him and stuff like that, well, I could, could probably make him happy all day and all night by visiting him with that train. He could take pictures and yeah, yeah, good times. <laughs> so all those images that you've seen with like what happened after the game was over and whatnot to an extent. Not like this right over here, though. Well, oh, or was it? <laughs> but you weren't expecting that, were you? <laughs> so... We got a little little drawing there, perhaps maybe from Nico, based on the way that that was all set up like that, you know, like the beginning of the game and whatnot. So who knows? Who knows who made that? I don't know if you'd actually be able to take a picture of said wandering spirit with Link, you know, flying alongside the chain or whatnot. But who knows? Huh? Like some, it like it depends on canon. Some. Some cameras and some things can take pictures of spirits, others not. I guess maybe in this case they were. But that didn't look like a picture, it looked more like a drawing. <laughs> and so, Link blows his whistle to alert Zelda, Hey, yeah, I'm in the area! How's it going there? They wave to each other. All is well in the world. The end. But, you know, there's still a little bit of stuff that I'd like to show you that I still haven't showed you and whatnot in terms of the games, like mini games and whatnot. So, you know, I'll have one more part after this. But for now, I'm going to end off the part here. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next part when we do so. Hopefully, I'll be able to get that all set up nice and quick. 